Jeopardy fans, Dr. Sanjay Gupta is stepping in as guest host. Here's what he had to say about taking on the job. You know, I, I think the, the, the well, I will say this. I, I did get a, ch a chance to briefly meet Alex once at a, at a ceremony, and we, we didn't get to talk much. I, I really wish we had. Um, but it was a favorite moment because he's Alex Trebek and he just carries himself a certain way and there's this, there's this energy that you feel and meeting Alex Trebek is almost assuredly going to be followed by telling all your friends you just met Alex Trebek, you know, so that was really good. But I do think um, as a kid watching Jeopardy with my parents, my parents are immigrants, English is not their first language and still they could, they could do well, uh, you know, when they played and, and I think it was, it was, um, it was inspiring for me to see them sort of come out like that over a quiz show game here in the United States. It wasn't something they ever dreamed of sort of just watching and answering and, and, and sort of, you know, trying to compete against one another. But we all did and, you know, even on a, on a tough day, sit around, watch Jeopardy, get a few questions right, give the right, right responses, that felt good. I think those are some of my favorite memories. Well, this is a show that I've watched for a long time. Uh, my parents, who are immigrants to this country, they're, they're numbers and data and facts people, engineers. They love Jeopardy, so we used to watch it together, and then I got a chance to watch it with my own kids, so when the opportunity came, it was the whole family really just so enthusiastic about this, and I, I jumped at the opportunity. My 15-year-old was the most excited. I mean, she is a, a, a really, really regular viewer. And she also, you know, takes great pride in getting, getting responses right that I don't get. <laughs> she just loves that. I think there's this dynamic that my parents were always going to be smarter than me, their son. And I was always going to be smarter and know more than the kids. And then Jeopardy sort of is this great equalizer. They have all these different categories. And all of a sudden, my 15-year-old is totally dissing on me. And so I get to be the host, and she's, she wanted to be here. She, she couldn't, but she was, she was terribly excited. I was super nervous. I didn't know exactly how this was going to, to, to play out. I'd never done anything quite like this. But I think what made me most nervous is that I have just tremendous respect for the show. So I think when you have tremendous respect for something, you want to just treat it with that respect and, and just get everything right. That's good, but it can also make you a bit nervous. The best piece of advice I got was from Mike Richards, the executive producer. We were just talking about the show and he, he brought up this idea that you, you do want to think about the players and have this empathy for them. It is such a big moment for them. I knew that because I'm a, I'm a viewer of the show. But to see the players and how they respond when they get something right, when they get something wrong, when they're crowned a Jeopardy champion, and you see, you see so many emotions going across their face, their whole body language changes. And I think once I felt that, I really wanted to nurture that. I think everything else sort of followed. Yeah, a Anderson and I had lots of conversations. Um, Anderson was also super nervous, which made me feel even more nervous. So that I don't know if that worked in my favor or not. But no, a Anderson had, you know, he had a lot of reminders, I think, about the fact that this is a really fast-paced show and that Alex just made it look so easy. Um, so, so I had that in the back of my head here as well. I knew that as easy as it may look because of how good Alex Trebek was at it, that I needed to do my work. I needed to do my homework. I needed to get the beats right and, and just, just take the time. Well, you know, in, in surgery, <laughs> obviously I'm taking care of patients in an operating room. And here, I feel like I'm taking care of, of players uh, on a stage in, in the middle of a TV show. The stakes are obviously not the same. But, but I think it's, it's a similar sort of dynamic in that I still want to care for those players the way that I would care for my patients. I think interestingly, being a surgeon uh, prepared me more for this role because there is a precision to this show. There's things you just got to get right, you got to get it in the right order, you got to do things a certain way each time. And um, you know, you, you want to make sure that you don't 
mess those things up. If you do, you can fix it, and that's what, you, what happens in surgery as well. But, but I think my surgical training in some ways probably prepared me better for this than being a journalist or anything else. You can watch Jeopardy! on WTLV at 7.30 p.m. We'll also share Dr. Gupta's interview on firstcoastliving.net.